Welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can download and install the VLC Media Player on your Windows 11 PC. So there are basically two methods to download and install the VLC Media Player on your Windows computer. And the first method is using the Microsoft Store, while the other method in which we use any web browser of our choice. So let us first cover the first and the more easiest one that is by using the Microsoft Store. So the first thing we need to do is access our Microsoft Store. To do this simply navigate your cursor towards the bottom and search for Microsoft Store. And here you can see this is the Microsoft Store right here. So simply double click on this and your Microsoft Store will fire up. Now inside the Microsoft Store you need to search for VLC and then hit the enter key. Once you will do this you can see the VLC media player right here. Simply click on it and after clicking on it you can see this install button right here. So simply click on to the install button and here you can see that it is preparing to download and the download has been started. And once the download will be completed it will automatically get installed into your system. So let us wait for the same and see if it will be installed or not. And here you can see that I have received this message which says do you want to allow this application to make changes to your device. So in order to proceed you need to click on to the yes option and just wait for the installation process to begin. And here you can see that the installation has been begun and it is currently installing the VLC into my system and once that will be done you can see that the installation has been successful. So if I search for VLC in my apps you can see that the app has been successfully downloaded. Now let us move on to the another method in case you don't want to use the Microsoft Store. So first let me uninstall the application and then let me reinstall it again. So here you can see that I have uninstalled the application and now let me show you the another method using which we can install the VLC media player. So as I have told you earlier the another method is using the web browser. So let me open any web browser of my choice for example let's say Google Chrome. So right now I am in Chrome and then the next thing you need to do is go to the search bar and type for VLC download. Once you will type and hit the enter button you will see this particular website as the first result which is www.videoland.org it is the official VLC media player website and then to download you need to click onto this website and you will be landed onto this particular interface now here you can see that it has automatically detected my operating system and the standard version that will best suit it. So it is suggesting me version 3.0.21 for Windows 64 bit and it is also showing the size of the application which is gonna be around 40 megabytes. And if you want to change the architecture or for different operating system then you need to click onto this drop down arrow and from here you can choose a variety of architectures or different operating systems. So then the next thing you need to do is click onto this download VLC button and you just need to wait for a few seconds and your download will get automatically started. If not, you need to click here. So let us wait and see if the download starts or not. And here you can see that the download has been started and once the application will be downloaded, we will install this. And here you can see that once the installation has been successfully completed we can click onto this folder icon and here you can see that this is the downloaded file that we have just downloaded now to extract it simply right click on it and click onto the open button and once you will do this it will start it will start the process of installation you might receive a notification on which you have to click yes and then it will ask you to select a language so currently i'm setting it to english and then i will click ok and here you can see that it is giving me a welcome screen so simply click on next and then you need to agree to this public license and if you want you may read it and then you need to click on to this next button and from here you have some other options like this is the custom stall or if you also want you can choose to have a minimum or a full installation as well i'm going to with the custom option and then you need to click on to the next button and then it will ask you for the destination folder 
where the VLC media player will be placed. So I am keeping it to default and then clicking on the install button. And here you can see that the installation phase has begun. And once this will be completed, it will be successfully installed. And here you can see that the setup has been successfully completed. And if I keep on the check in this check mark, it will run the VLC media player once I hit the finish button. So here you can see that the VLC media player has been successfully launched and installed into a system. So that's all for this video. If this video was helpful to you, do make sure to give it a like. Tell us in the comment if it helped you or not or if there are any suggestions or questions you want to ask. And also don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.